Hold on to your horses, folks. Hey, everyone. It's your host, Stacey Eich, and you're watching In Living Cover, and I'm here at the second annual Kids' Choice Sports Awards, and guess who we talked to? Okay, what's your favorite emoji to send in a text? So cute. Yes. Okay. Chin down, okay. tits out. <laughs> Where are you from? I'm from Texas, like you. Chocolate. You're the only person I've told. Are you ready? I'm ready. Exclusive. Exclusive. Say it again. Exclusive. 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 This is you guys' second nomination, am I right? Yes. 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 You know your stuff. You know, I'm trying. As you can see, it is crazy here at the Kids' Choice Sports Awards 2015, and it is about to be game time. I got the scoop from Nick Cannon, Heidi Klum, The Real Housewives of New York, and RuPaul. You gotta stay tuned. You guys usually don't get along. What's oh, happening right now? The new season. You know, the legendary RuPaul. Legendary. With that gorgeous smile. Oh goodness. my goodness, thank you. None of the teeth in my head are real, so. <laughs> you have a lot coming up. You, can we talk about this Will Smith movie that we're about to do? Can we talk about it? For season one, I ate a lot of kettle popcorn. For season two, do I need to change it up? Like, what, what's going to be different? You just need an oxygen mask and some vodka. Oxfords or loafers? Oxfords. High waisted or high low? High waisted. French braid or top do? French braid. Ooh, all the way. Yep. Uh, the 25 year old version of you, what did you think the six year old version of you would look like? Well, you know, I started in civil rights very young. I never thought I'd get to 60s. <laughs> You're in the fashion world now, which you've always been, but now you have your own title. Yeah. Who do you want to collab with? Ooh. Uh, what's on your bucket list before you turn 30? Oh my gosh. Uh, what's something that makes you not afraid of your imperfections? Mm. Okay. This is a Mizzou grad this is here. University of Missouri right here. We're having a moment. <laughs> First of all, quick question. Did your team win? I know. I'm sorry. I just wanted to... Oh, I'm so... What does it take to get looking this good? What, what's your inspiration so far? About three pairs of man's spank. Did you watch the season finale of Scandal? Honey, I mean, did I? Yes, I did. <laughs> I'm hearing some things are happening with you and Miss Kenya Moore. Yes. Explain, please. Yes, she dated James. Um, at the time of filming, he was not married. You talk the same way that you write. You know, because your lyrics, I would say, are very honest. Thank you. Like, they're I just love that. So what kind of gets you in that place of honesty. I, I got used to writing in the same place, the same room. This is the episode before the season finale. Oh, my gosh. What the heck happens for the next four episodes? I wonder what they were like before they said, action. I just wonder what they were talking about. Because I know they were like, I love you, I love you. You get on my nerves. Like, I just wonder. <laughs> I, I, yeah, you gotta look it I'll up. tweet it to you. Uh, you tweet to me. Good, 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 good. I don't, you know, as your mentor, I don't really have that much work to do. I just fan your flame. Thank you. You're awesome. Good to see you. Well, you're very beautiful. Man. Great job. Thank you so much. I love her. Uh, do you have your own? Like, yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. Congratulations. You. To keep in touch, you can find me on Instagram and Twitter at One Take Stace. Don't get diabetes messing with her. No. Love you for that.